my first time in Chicago. The hotel room is super cute. Um, I prepared really well because it is pretty windy out there, uh, but not as bad as I thought it was gonna be. There's just like a bit of snow. I think um, my friend and I, who we're gonna see later, picked a really great weekend to go because we're actually gonna have sun tomorrow and we have a little bit of sun today, but I literally wore like three layers. I have my... Um, great pea coat made from recycled material uh, from Urban Outfitters. I have my Italian yarn uh, sweater, which is like the warmest sweater I have. And then underneath I have like a, a Nike, like long sleeved shirt, um, black jeans, and then I have snowshoes, um, but not much snow on the sidewalk. So probably gonna walk around, see if I can get some late lunch cause it's about uh, four o'clock um, and we're not having dinner till much later and I kind of skipped lunch so it'll be like a very late lunch but yeah I'm so excited to be here and experience Chicago for the first time let's go I forgot to mention that I did actually wear warm leggings underneath my black jeans so I have two layers of pants on as well as like my snowshoes and then my three layers of like coats and plus shirts um, but yeah, I'm really warm and I'm ready to go walk around before it gets too dark and find some late lunch. been here for a few hours and I'm already in love with Chicago. It's awesome. It's like somewhere between Atlanta and New York, but everybody walks. People are so friendly. I mean, yeah, it's cold, but it's kind of worth it. <laughs> I walked to a pizzeria about eight minutes from the Kimpton Allegro, which is um, our hotel. And I'm about to cross the street, so I have to go, but pizza was so good. And I'm walking back so I can meet um, my friend Bianca, and we're gonna go to dinner in about an hour. So yay, more food. Bye. <laughs> just got dressed um, it's Saturday we're ready for another day full of activities um, I'm wearing this turtleneck that's quite warm from American Apparel um, and this cardigan from Primark and jeans from American Eagle I am wearing warm leggings under my jeans again and I'm gonna double up on my socks too just because it was fine during the day yesterday, but it got really cold at night and I actually had to go 
um, to the convenience store across from the hotel and buy this beanie because my ears were getting numbingly chilled. So I think it'll be much better today now that I have it. Um, and then last night, Bianca and I went to The Loop to have dinner and we ended up at this Italian restaurant called Formentos and it was really, really good. Um, the food was just absolutely delicious and it was a really casual sort of, but still, you know, high class place. Um, anyways, it was good. And um, now I'm just waiting for Bianca to get back from her workout class so that we can go get a little bit of breakfast um, and get our day started. So I forgot to mention that by the end of the night yesterday, which was like about 11, we got back to the hotel room around um, 10.30. Uh, my skin was starting to peel around my nose and like eyebrows. So I think it's absolutely key, especially if you're from the South and your skin's not used to it, to come up here if you're visiting or whatnot with some shea butter because this came super in handy last night to put it on right before bed and kind of moisturize and now my skin like looks like pretty fine it's not peeling anymore so yeah besides that i love this native deodorant because it doesn't dry out like my underarms too badly so i love it i got the cucumber in mint and it's paraben free and aluminum free and it's just really like good deodorant and it's actual it's an actual natural deodorant that works so and then can't leave the house without chapstick because your lips will dry out and if you're not prepared you're gonna be peeling like i was so yeah love these <laughs> and you can get them at any convenience store so okay bianca's here <laughs> shopping here there's a Nordstrom there's like it's like a little mall um, and there are shops like out on the street too like Zara and all of that so it's like a cool little shopping area um, me and Bianca parted ways after the goddess in the bakery um, where we had breakfast um, and now I'm probably gonna take the bus back to Kimpton Allegro, our hotel, because I've been over here for about an hour. I might grab a chai or a cappuccino or something for my ride, but I got a uh, venture ticket for all day so I can take the bus back whenever I want. I did walk over here from the Goddess in the Bakery, but yeah, it's fun. <laughs> Buckingham Fountain and what's really cool is that Lake Michigan is right over there so I thought it'd be on for some reason but I guess the fountain isn't turned on this time of year just because of how cold it is but um, yeah I saw it 
I can say I did it. And now it's time to find some chai. in Chicago. We're headed to dinner. Um, just as an update, my phone died earlier after the park um, and I went to Corner Bakery and then walked around the river walk for a bit, but um, ended up back at the hotel somehow without getting too lost. And yeah, now we're headed to dinner. Okay. Bye. <laughs> he was like, uh... <laughs> Very much like a shark dog. These are chopsticks. <laughs> They're not chopsticks. <laughs> Hey guys, so I just got back to Atlanta from Chicago. It was such a great experience. We had an amazing, amazing time in the Windy City. So yeah, I'll definitely be back to visit but um, the flight went really well. Didn't do much after dinner last night. It was pretty uneventful. We just went back to our hotel room and went to bed because we had to be up this morning to get a quick breakfast and head to the airport. But um, yeah, it was such a great time and I loved doing this video. So see you guys in the next one. Bye.